His policies are so bad. Uh, his military policies are uh, insane. They're insane. These are wars that will never end with him. He will drive us into World War III, and we're closer to World War III than anybody can imagine. We are very, very close to World War III, and he's driving us there. And Kim Jong-un and uh, President Xi of China, Kim Jong-un of North Korea, uh, all of these, Putin, they don't respect him, they don't fear him, they have nothing going with this gentleman, and he's going to drive us into World War III. You want a World War III, let him follow and win, and let Putin say, do what you want, NATO. Just do what you want. There's a thing called Article 5. An attack on one is an attack on all, a required response. The idea, the idea, I can't think of a single major leader in the world who wouldn't trade places with, with the job I've done and what they've done. Because we are a powerful nation. We have wonderful peace. Because of the people, not me, it's because of the American people. They're capable of anything, and they step up when they're needed. And right now, we're needed. We're needed to protect the world because our own safety is at stake. And again, you want to have a war, just let Putin go ahead and take Kyiv, make sure they move on, see what happens in Poland, Hungary, and other places along that border. Then you have a war. Uh, Russia, they took a lot of land from Bush. They took a lot of land from Obama and Biden. They took no land, nothing from Trump, nothing. He knew not to do it. You're not going to play games with me. He knew that. I got along with him very well, but he knew not to play games. He took nothing from me. But now he's going to take the whole thing from this man right here. That's a war that should have never started. It would have never started ever with me. And he's going to take Ukraine. And, you know, you asked me a question before, would you do this? With he's got us in such a bad position right now with, with Ukraine and Russia. Because Ukraine's not winning that war. He said, I will never settle until such time. They're running out of people. They're running out of soldiers. They've lost so many people. It's so sad. They've lost so many people, and they've lost those gorgeous cities with the golden domes that are a thousand years old, all because of him and stupid decisions. Russia would have never attacked if president I were president. Trump, the question